God, dude, I hate girls like that. I hate people like that. If anyone, if you, if you know someone like that, fuck that. That's a toxic relationship. You tell them they're a piece of shit. And they need to change or get the fuck out of your life. God, man, I need a drink. Hello, peoples. My name is Gerald Pointo. Welcome back to Lydia. It's, this game is so far getting to me, but let's continue. Ta-da! How could you? You left me. Where is he? Teddy. Are you? Oh, Teddy. Where are you? You want it a little bit. Teddy. Dude, they're still fighting downstairs. That shit's not okay. There's like a lot of things going down. Teddy, where are you? Oh, are you on top of the bed? Do I have to go back in the closet? I just want to make sure there's nothing else that I'm missing. Can I go outside this time? Dude, they, they legit sound louder. The last time I fucking... Like, the last time they were like fighting, and now they're like, sound like they're brawling. The lights. Oh, here we go, today. No more monsters. Just fun, please. Oh, dude, what the f fuck? Oh no. What the fuck is that guy? Who the fuck is that guy? Where do you think you're going? What do you care, Frank? You ain't going nowhere. But shit your face and back to your room. Fucking slob, you smelly bastard. Fuck you, Frank. Fuck you. Oh, you we already know how to get past him. Yes. Um. Hello. This is your neighbor. Uh. The police. The police. The police. We're doing a survey. Could you check your windows outside for us? Are you serious? On a Saturday evening? I pay my tax dollars to the time, and you expect me to do your job? So you're concerned about my windows and come check them yourselves? Well, we're gonna try this again. Don't mind me, I'm not calling you from down the hall. Hello. Um. Um. Hello, this is Pizza Delivery. We'll be there shortly with your order. I'm on fucking welfare. You can deliver the pizza, but I ain't gonna pay for it. Bye. Well, that didn't fucking work. Fucking, you're all drunk and everything. That doesn't help you being on welfare. It's only the third call in a row. Yes. Um, hello, this is your neighbor next door. Hello, weird time for a phone call. What do you want? It's about your car. It's about your car. What about it? Well... Uh, someone scratched it. Someone scratched it. What? Are you serious? For fuck's sake! The paint job was under a week old. There were some guys. Did you get a good look at them? First, they tried to pry open the doors, but then they just started to scratch the car. Christ Almighty! Did you see the bastards? Where did they go? They went to the mall. 
If you're fast, you can still catch them. Thanks. Son of a bitch. Fucking guy is wasted, dude. Didn't even realize how any of that fucking call was important. Or even made sense. Oh, I'm a teenager now. Oh. Why am I growing up like this? My mom? What the fuck? Where the hell are you going? In the middle of the night? I... Behind my back? Making me worm myself sick? Where are you going? I, um... Don't babble like an idiot. Answer the question. Direct. To a party with my friends. Oh, a party? How nice. Whoring and drinking and drugs. Or whatever else kids do these days. Go on then, I hope you had the time of your life. Some of these days, You'll get what's coming for you. Dude, what the fuck? She looks like she's trash too. What kind of bullshit is this? Oh, dude, I love this song. Phew. Oh, fuck, what is it? Um, it's not Angel Baby. Oh, fuck, and now I'm stuck. Sheila. Yo, let's meet at the playground. I'm so hyped. See you soon. Dude, I, I, it's killing me that I can't remember the name of this song. Is, I, I feel like it's Angel Baby, but I, I'm pretty sure I'm wrong, and it's a completely other oldie song in that I'm fucking mixing it up with. Oh, dude, my friends. Aww. Hey there, buddies. Hey there, peoples. I'm here for a happy time. My life is shit. Slow down, buddy. Let the girl pass. Sorry about that. It's okay. Okay. Are you okay? Everything is wrong. I want to get away. I can't take it anymore. Oh. Oh no! I'm fine. Oh, that fucks with me. Oh no. Bye, guys. Oh no. She's going through the depression because her life sucks. It's not even her fault either. She's just gr growing up in a shitty home. A home where her father left her. A home where her mother doesn't give a shit about her whoring around and drinking. Her fucking her mother married some or um, is with some asshole that's fucking drunk all the time. <sighs> Looks like Sheila and Steve are late. I've got some time to kill. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, I've done that. I did them sad spins. Oh, Sheila, you there yet? We're gonna be a little late. Sorry. See you soon. Come on, guys. Don't leave me waiting here forever. Can I do the hopscotch, please? One, two, three, four, five, six. I did it. Oh, man, this really sucks. Oh, there's a slide. I want to go on the slide. Where the fuck are you? Get back. Home now. Mm. You're not my dad. You're not my dad. <laughs> Your name is Frank. Oh, my God. Oh, the slide. Let me slide. Just for a little bit of happiness and purity that I miss when I was a child. Uh, do I have to press a button? 
I pressed the button. Oh. Hey, over there, over there, over there. Oh, I'm on my way. I'm on the that my mother wants me to do. Because that's what she said it do. Oh, dude, they're jabs. Yeah. Sorry we're late. Steve had some engine trouble. It's okay. Did you get everything? Um, dude, he's going fast. Well, yes. I had some trouble. Oh, yeah. Steve, we need to get there today. I'm going as fast as I can. Uh, sorry, I asked. I'm going to get so wasted tonight. So, you want to roll? Shot or beer? Uh, whatever works, right? Right. Steve and I were talking the other day. Anything about you? So? My oldest friend is almost a stranger. I never really thought about it until now. But I, for one, want to know who I'm riding with. Monster, eh? Had any luck catching it? No. <laughs> no. It was more of a scary thought. I actually know that the boogeyman is real, you know? I'll come. Because it sure sounds like you should be hunting for my Steve. You, you, who, how, who can be a huge asshole sometimes? No. Why? What's wrong with them? Nothing, but, uh. So Steve's not too good for you, huh? Jesus Christ, Sheila. God, I don't like people like that. That want to cause problems just to cause problems? Fuck people like that. Those people are the toxic pieces of shits, and you should cut them out of your life and punch them in the dick. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. There's been a lot of that lately. So tell me about this monster of yours. What's it look like? Big, small. I don't know. I'm not sure. I bet it's just your imagination playing tricks on you. You're not a child anymore, you know. Pay, atten pay no attention to Sheila. We all have our monsters. Dude, he sounds so evil. What the fuck? There's no shame in that. Steve! God! I'm so sorry. What a piece of shit. You're an asshole. You're a bitch. Christ. Dude, oh, she's... Br I'm all of smokes. Sheila, could you pass me a new pack? Fuck you, Steve! What the fuck? Um, uh, the first one? There it is. Oh, dude, what else is there? A spoon, a knife, a condom, some smokes, some vodka, a marker, and a brush. Well, as long as there's no drugs in there, I guess it's okay. <laughs> Cheers, darling. How come you're so sure that this monster of yours is real? Truth. I've seen what it does to my parents. That's how I know it exists. Maybe you, you just think about stuff too much. Kid stuff, you know? Hey, baby. Let the girl answer, would you? Well, excuse me. While I'm trying to have a conversation here, here we go again. What do you mean? Again! I'm such a burden for you to bear. Come on, babe. Let's just drop this before it gets any worse, okay? Right. God, dude, I hate girls like that. I hate people like that. If anyone, if you, if you know someone like that, fuck that. That's a toxic relationship. You're tell them they're a piece of shit. And they need to change or get the fuck out of your life. God. Man, I need a drink. Here you go, bud. I got you. So, smart off. <sighs> Thanks. You're so weird, you know? To tell the truth, I don't know anything about you. Where do you come from? You know where I live. You've. I mean, if we didn't hang out with you, you'd probably spend all your time on that playground by yourself. You know, I almost feel sorry for you. Don't talk to her like that. 
Jesus, Sheila, if you ask a question, the fuck, Steve? You just won't let it go. Why can't you let it go? She's just a weird kid on our backseat who cares what she's got to say. Sheila, she's right next to you. Why the hell do you care so much of what she's got to say? Are you two sleeping together? Huh? God. I Answer me! You bastard! God damn it, Sheila! I'm sick and tired of the same fucking song. It's all in your head. I keep telling you that over and over again. You know Steve's right. Yeah, there's nothing between us. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. Do you think I'm blind? I see the way you look at each other. Dude, what the fuck? Feels so stupid. Shit. How long has this been going on? Gee, you really think that I'm that stupid? We've been together since we were kids. I've always been good to you. And this is how you think me? Sheila, this is all in your head. <sighs> Fuck, dude. Um, interrupt. Excuse me? Shut up! Nobody asks you anything. Dude, what the fuck? Dude, what a piece of shit. Look out! Oh, we crashed. We fucking crashed. Oh, I knew what was happening. I knew it was gonna happen since we got in the car and he was going faster than the. Oh, shit, dude. Ah, oh, shit. Oh. Dude. Oh, no. Fuck, we're flipped over. Everything hurts. I, everything's red. I, oh, shit, dude. Oh, my knife. Oh, are you okay, Sheila? Oh, I got my blade. That's all that matters. Oh, get me out of here. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. What did I tell you? Didn't I tell you that you get what's coming? Do you have any idea what this does to me? You're such a piece of shit. How the fuck do you do that to or your daughter like that? I... You're happy to be alive. Do you know what happened to your friends? I... I don't know what happened. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious right now? You have no idea what you've been up to? No. That friend of yours, Steve, was drunk. And he drove a car, and then the car crashed. Um, what happened to Steve, Sheila and Steve? They're both dead. That poor girl in the front seat got smashed through the windshields. I mean, it was kind of her fault. I'm so ashamed of you. I hope you're proud of yourself. Papa. Oh. oh no. Papa. I. Uh, oh no. Papa. The only reason you're still alive is that someone pulled you out of the wreck. Oh. But that doesn't bring back your friends now, does it? Oh. What happened to you? Why do you do this to me? Oh, dude, we gotta tell her. Uh, I was in the back seat. I gave him the bottle. They're dead because of me. Oh. I don't know you anymore. I. You're a piece of shit. You're dead to me. This is a police matter, you know. You have to face the consequences. All by yourself. You're not a child anymore. And I have to deal with the social services. What the hell have I done to deserve this? Dude, what the fuck? How can you treat her like that? That's not fucking okay. She just went through a traumatic experience. Chapter 4, The Matriarch. You've ruined everything. Alright, everyone. I'm gonna leave the episode here. This game 
is super emotional and to say the very least it's pretty fucked up thank you guys so much for watching my name is Ben Charo Point now I'm gonna finish this game I feel like we're probably getting close to the end considering we're an adult already the last one please follow me on all my social media crap down below like subscribe to the video and I'll see you guys in the next video later